Brett, thanks. Joining us now is Jade Esteban Estrada. He is here from San Antonio, all the way from San Antonio. That's right. <laughs> He's going to be performing tonight uh, at Venture Theater, and we were discussing earlier what your official title would be, and I guess musician slash comedian. Mm -hmm. um, tonight's performance is for the Yellowstone AIDS Project, so we'll talk a little bit about okay. uh, why you're coming and what the performance is all about. Awesome. All right, uh, so let's talk about the performance. Okay, um, uh, I'm doing uh, my, I believe this is my ninth show. I have 10 shows in my repertoire. It's called A Lullaby for Ryan, The History of HIV and AIDS in America. And it's a musical comedy. And I, I'm touring it around the country, uh, working a lot with um, uh, HIV and AIDS awareness uh, organizations around the country that, um, that uh, bring awareness to people via workshops, education, uh, services for clients. And I like to come in and do those kinds of things uh, via my, my skills as like a comedian as, and, and as a musician. Let's talk a little bit about your background then before we go into more of what's going to be <clears throat> happening tonight. You've done stuff with Comedy Central, correct? Mm -hmm. I've been on the Graham Norton effect. All right. That's spanked by a dominatrix. That was my first <laughs> episode. <laughs> so what are some of the other things you've done in the past then so that people can kind of get an idea of who you are? And I used to be uh, the choreographer for Charo, Coochie Coochie. Mm -hmm. um, I used to be a, a scratch vocalist for the Backstreet Boys. Um, I'm a stand-up comic. Um, I do a lot of solo theater. Um, I do a lot of things that pertain to social issues, whether they be illegal immigration, um, uh, assimilation in the Hispanic community. I do. I have a whole series of shows about um, lesbian and gay bisexual transgender history. Uh, it's called the the lesbian and gay history of the world icons, and uh, this one, the lullaby for Ryan, uh, really. Uh, it was something I really felt that needed to be expressed in this way because sometimes people get turned off in this generation about, you know, safer sex, about any kind of protection against STDs, and people just like zone out. And then you see these numbers going up about people being, you know, contracting things that they know better about. Um, and I find that by doing things like this, like, you know, making them laugh and making them kind of like sing along with me to, to, to facts and information and history that they should know kind of leaves them, uh, has them leaving the theater, you know, actually humming these tunes, but actually having learned something. And that's important to me. That, that I feel is my calling. All right. So real quickly, how did you make it out here to Yellowstone County in Billings tonight? Uh, I got on a, on a plane. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. I, I, well, I was like, well, it's better than the last time because I came on a bus. So, like, oh. I'm moving on up in the world. <laughs> Is this something the Yellowstone AIDS Project contacted you about, or do you feel very strongly about coming to this area? Oh, I feel very strongly about coming to rural areas. Um, not that I think Billings is rural at all. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big city. But I think it's important to bring um, things like this uh, to, to, the, to, to the world because it's people will pay attention more i think if you stand them up and look them straight in the eye and start singing and dancing uh and that's why i prefer to be a touring artist rather than just stay in new york or just stay in los angeles and do these things because i think that's where the people really need it most okay and real quickly tonight venture theater venture 8 p.m theater, 8 p.m 8 p.m uh, tickets are ten dollars uh you can find out more information at the yellowstone AIDS Project or at my website, getjaded.com. And by the way, I usually, <laughs> I, I thought I was going to perform today, so I came all, all dressed up, nowhere to sing. Yeah, so. unfortunately, <laughs> technical difficulties are not allowing us uh, to allow him to sing today. So if you really want to get an idea of what he can do, Venture Theater tonight, 8 p.m., $10. It's good for what, 13, ages 13 and up? 13 and up. Mm -hmm. All right, mm -hmm. Jade, thank you so much for Thanks joining for us me, this Emily. morning. <laughs> and just to head on today in Montana, the end of the HD versus.